Hey YouTube, welcome back guys. So I was uh, trying to take my trash out to my uh, garbage uh, bin. And uh, I was uh, just uh, looking down below my water heater and I found out the, there's like a pot of water. It's on this uh, raised uh, drywall. Okay. So we have a big uh, problem with the leaks. So I'm going to show you guys a tutorial on how to uh, troubleshoot your uh, water leak that needs to be replaced or not. Okay. This one is the Rim uh, Guardian uh, system, 40 uh, gallon and then uh, 40,000 uh, BTU. This one is the natural uh, gas uh, model, not the electric one. As you can see, there's a gas uh, line coming in to this uh, electric uh, ignition right here. All right, first of all, you guys want to see if there's any leaks. Uh, this is where the shutoff uh, valve is at. And this is a water line that's coming from the city. And it goes in here. And then on the left hand side, this is where the hot water coming out. Gotta be careful, it's gonna be a hot uh, pipe. So you want to inspect it. And then uh, here is the exhaust uh, pipe. So yeah, it looks like there's no leak where the water lines are coming at. Or uh, out. And then the next thing you want to inspect is this uh, pressure uh, relief uh, valve. You want to make sure if there's anything uh, dripping down. So this line go outside and then uh, drip it to outside yard. And then here is a drainage right here. And uh, doesn't seem like it's leaking. Sometimes if you drain it and then there's some nice like, sediment around here, you might have to like play with it. Make sure all the sediment uh, goes out or you might have a uh, slow leak and it's just uh, dripping down here. Okay. So I have uh, two uh, water heater that goes uh, side by side. Cause uh, this is a big house, so to in a, another thing is to determine if it is another leak is to open this uh, panel right here or the cover, and uh, you want to touch the this uh, fiberglass uh, thing, and make sure if it's wet or not. 
So, by the look at it, or touching and sense it, it's not wet. And uh, when I press it down, it is not wet, but I have to push it down lower. As you see, when I press it, the water is coming through from the bottom panel and coming out. So definitely uh, this one is bad. So I had to replace uh, this, this side. And I inspect the other side. Those are the water that's le leaking from the right hand side to the left, left side. So I got some of this rag and I cleaned it earlier and now the water is coming out again. So I have to use like a wet bag, maybe try to suck it up and uh, troubleshoot some more, but most likely I need to replace uh, this uh, old uh, water heater. It's been here since uh, 2003, so it is uh, pretty old. I was kind of surprised that it lasts up to like 15 to 16 years. So, you know, those uh, water sentiment, it causes uh, all the appliances to break faster. But I think uh, 15 years or 16 years, that's uh, quite long enough. Normally, this kind of water heater, they, I think the high was like, they range from 6 years, 9 years, and up to 12 years. So, I got a uh, pretty long life out of this, I think, so. Anyway, hopefully uh, you guys uh, give a thumbs up and then uh, like the video. Please uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on that bell for notification, or drop in the comments on below. And hopefully I can try to uh, make a tutorial on how to install this uh, water heater. Thank you for watching. See you guys on the next one. Bye always. Peace. <laughs>